Hello friends, welcome back. I hope you've tried out adding an element to the couple and checked out and resolved the error that we have got in the uh, at the end of the last video. Hope you tried out this using the append and adding an element to the couple. So we are in this video. We are going to see the next important uh, data types, which is sets. Right. So as we have seen the properties for list tuples, sets are unordered, unordered, and unchangeable. And the third important point is duplicates not allowed. Okay, let's try out checking these properties. Let's try out understanding how do I declare sets. Right. So how we have seen for list and tuples. Okay, so list the set also is declared that way. Set one equal to in the list we have seen with square braces. In tuples we have seen with round braces. And obviously for the sets now we will have be using flower braces. So it is declared with flower braces. Say I'll say red blue and black. So you can assume that set is nothing but say if you have a basket and I'm giving you different color balls and you put it in the basket. So when you try to pick a ball, you do not know which ball will come to your hand. Similarly, so that is the meaning of unordered. Say I have, though I have given red, blue, black, right? So if I try to print this, What is the expected thing? You are expecting, you might be expecting red, blue, black. Let's see what you get. See, you got blue, black, red. I will rerun it again. Blue, black, red. So that means you need not get the same order. You need not get same order. Right. So this is the first property that is the unordered property. So let's check another one. I will add one more red. As I mentioned, duplicates not allowed. So when I try to print that again, you will see only one red here. No matter I have added, I have given input as two reds. So but the output it does not display the duplicates. Okay. So now say suppose I want to add one more element to it. What I can do is set one dot add is a function to add the element. Okay. This we have seen in the previous as append or something in the list case. So here also I will add it. So I'll give orange. Okay, now orange got added. Though I, you, you might be expecting in other cases, orange gets appended at the last. But see here, uh, orange got added at the beginning. So order, there will be absolutely no order when you declare sets. So what, what did we learn now? So we learned the declaration, how to create sets. Then how do we print it? And we have seen two properties, unordered and the duplicates not allowed are the properties that we have seen. Adding a, another element to the set we have seen. Say suppose I have two sets. I have another set. Set 2 which is equal to. Ball. Bat.
wicket. So this is another set I have. Right. So what I do is I want to add these two things. I want to add these two things. So what I can do is set one dot update set two. Now I'll print again set one. Okay, let's see the output. So both the sets, set one and set two, got added. Right. So we have seen another property. How do we add two sets? Right. So this is an another important video where we learnt about sets, creation of sets, adding an element to the set. Right. Then we have seen the properties of uh, why sets does not intake the duplicates and then how do we add an element how do we uh, uh, join two sets right these are the things that we have seen in the video see you in the next video please try out this